you guys know any old people? You know, old person? Like, how old would they be, maybe? Um, 72. 72, yeah. Uh, that's, th there was someone in the Bible even older than that, he was 74. And God told him, Yeah, you're going to become a daddy, and, and your wife's going to have a baby. And uh, it's gonna be great because through your line, uh, there'll be lots of, there'll be a nation will grow from that one family. And uh, eventually, Jesus will come through that line. He was 74. For 25 years, he didn't hear about that promise again. So he thought, maybe I heard it wrong. Because that baby wasn't born or that announcement wasn't reminded, he wasn't reminded of that, but he was 99. And his wife was 90. Can you imagine a 99 year old man and a 90 year old lady having a little baby? That's hard to imagine. It doesn't seem possible. And yet God tells us that through him, all things are possible if we'll believe in what he promises and believe what he says. And it did happen. Isaac was born. And it was so, it was so much fun that they named him Isaac. You know what that means? A laughing. They were just so surprised that God had kept his promise just the way he did that they laughed whenever they said his name. God keeps his promise. And sometimes, you know, you're, pretty, you're pretty young, so sometimes it might seem like God is taking his time to keep his promise. Doesn't it? Sometimes you feel like promises are, I don't know what's going to happen. And yet God always keeps his promises at the perfect time. And if we'll learn to trust in him, what he says will always, always happen at exactly the perfect time. That's a good thing about God. Because we're impatient. Have you ever been impatient? You want something, you want it right now? Me too. I'm that way too. But God wants us to trust in him because when he makes a promise, we can count on it. It's going to happen. Let's pray. Father, you've made a lot of promises to us. And we, we hear about them in Sunday school, we hear about them in church, we hear about them when we read Bible stories together. Lord, help us to trust you that all the promises you have made and all the promises that you are making, you will keep, even if it doesn't come as fast as we want it to. Help us to trust you in Jesus' name.